All right, y'all, where we back with another one. Check this out today on my YouTube channel. We're going over how to buy different altcoins on Uniswap using Coinbase Wallet. Go ahead, leave a like, comment, subscribe. Turn on post notifications for your boy, Yon World. Now, I'm making this video because I get this question a lot. How do you buy all of the coins I'm investing in? Now, the cryptocurrency I like to buy are called ERC20 tokens. And in order to buy these different altcoins, you have to have Ethereum first. So, in order to buy these coins, you have to buy Ethereum first. I'm about to explain how to do that if you're 100% a beginner. So, the first thing you would want to do is you would want to download Coinbase, right? Coinbase and Coinbase Wallet are two different apps. So the first thing you have to do is download Coinbase and you have to verify all of your information. When you verify all of your information, you increase your limits and you're able to buy more and you're able to withdraw more. So I recommend going on Coinbase first, verifying all your information and getting that situated. After that, you download Coinbase Wallet and then you will link both of the accounts. You link them by just going to buy and transfer from Coinbase. The first time you do that, it'll tell you to link the accounts. And once you link the accounts, you're able to buy Ethereum directly from Coinbase Wallet and fund your Coinbase Wallet. Another way you can get Ethereum on this wallet is by sending it directly to this wallet. So a lot of y'all, if you knew, you probably don't know how to do that. So I just recommend using Coinbase and Coinbase Wallet. It's real simple. So after you have Ethereum on your account, after you buy Ethereum, you can buy Ethereum right here. It'll use whatever bank account you have attached or whatever credit card you have attached to Coinbase. After you buy Ethereum, you'll see it in your account within three minutes. It'll appear here. Then the bottom four buttons, you click on those bottom four buttons and this is the Coinbase browser. In the Coinbase browser, you will go to Uniswap, right? I already have it bookmarked so I can easily go to it. But the website is app.uniswap.org. That's the website. After you go to Uniswap, this is where you would swap your Ethereum for the different tokens. Now, when you press select the token, you can buy any token on the Ethereum blockchain, right? Any ERC20 token you can buy right here on Uniswap if it's listed on Uniswap. So you can either search it by name or paste the address. A lot of coins I invest in early, so you would have to paste the address. Let me just show you what that looks like. This is a coin, an early project that I was looking at. You would copy the token contract to the clipboard, and then you would go back out to Coinbase Wallet you would paste that address. I already added the coin, but you will see an import button right here. Then you would import the token and then you will have it right there. From here, you could, you know, press max. And this token is not live yet. So if I just use another example of a random ERC20 token, right? This is the basic attention token. But um, you would, to buy this token, if you wanted to buy this token, you would select how much Ethereum you want. So right now I got it set to the max, but you can always change this. And you can say like 0 0.05 or 0 0.2, 0 0.5, you know, 0.6, however much you want to spend, right? And then you will press swap, confirm swap. And right now the minor fee, or this is also called a gas fee. The minor fee is $49 or $48, excuse me, right? $48 and 50 cent is the minor fee. It's real cheap right now. It's early in the morning. So, you know, the minor fees are cheap right now, but after you pay, right, it will just confirm the payment. Right, it'll, it'll say uh, transaction submitted right here. It wouldn't say error. It'll say transaction submitted. And you will see it uh, confirming in the top right-hand corner. After you get a successful check mark, you will see a green successful check mark. You will be able to go back to your wallet and see the coin within your balance. Right, you'll be able to see the coin you bought within your balance. So let's say if you wanted to sell that coin, 
I said if you wanted to sell it, you would press this middle button, you would go back to Uniswap, right? We, we went back to Uniswap in a browser, and then you would press this middle button, and then you would swap out whatever coin for Ethereum. When you sell your altcoin, right, you would have to pay a Uniswap protocol fee, and then you have to pay another minor fee, right? Now, minor fees can range from, you know, $40, they can be as high as $200 or more sometimes. So just always expect that minor fees can be high, right? And once you sell, it'll be back in Ethereum. And once you have the money in Ethereum, you can do a lot with it. Like Ethereum is a universal cryptocurrency. It can be transferred back to dollars. It can be transferred to Bitcoin or it can be transferred to other cryptocurrency. So once it's in Ethereum, that's the main coin. Ethereum is the main coin. So that's why you need Ethereum to buy the coin. And when you sell the coin, you are get you're giving back Ethereum, right? You're giving back Ethereum whenever you sell it. So you could trade your Ethereum back all the way back into your bank account to US dollars. So y'all got to know that too. But yeah. That's how you buy different altcoins on Uniswap. If y'all didn't understand what I explained on this video, I will have it in full text form in the description and in a pinned comment on this video. So make sure y'all check that out. It's your boy, Yon World. If y'all had any questions, please leave a comment on this video.